cut off the cord strapping. Open the wire feeder packaging box. Take out the wire feeder. Open the anti-shaking foam. Open the wire feeder side panel. Take out the accessories included with machine shipment. Take out the red wire feeding tube. Take out the cross screwdriver. Open the wire feeding wheel lock. Insert the red wire feeding tube's inlet into the wire feeding device. Unscrew the original wire feeding roller of the wire feeding device. Replace it with wire feeding roller, which is included with the machine shipment and have the same inside diameter with wire feeding nozzle and the welding wire diameter. Open the welding wire disc and lock the nut. Load the welding wire. Pass the welding wire through the welding wire tube. Feed through two welding wire wheels. Enter the red welding wire tube. Fasten and lock the wire feeding wheel. Tighten the two red locking handles. Close the wire feeder side panel. Open the welding machine packaging box. Check the welding machine packing list. Take out the anti-shaking foam, check the power cord. The blue one is the neutral wire. The red one is the live wire. The yellow one is the ground wire. Take out the safety ground lock wire. Install the round power terminal to the welding machine ground lock wire connection column and tighten, open the welding machine power socket protective cover. Connect the power cord aviation plug. Insert the signal line 5-pin aviation plug. Insert the other end of the signal aviation plug. Connect the live wire and neutral wire to the correct position of the 220V air protection switch. Ground the ground wire. Take out the scale tube and the corresponding nozzle. Each copper nozzle has a serial number on it. Choose according to the type of the welding wire. Open the welding head dust cover. Loosen the dust port nut. Insert the scale tube into the welding head dust port. Adjust the scale to zero. Insert the gas tube into the welding machine gas hole socket. Open the gas cylinder. Open the gas flow control switch. In the case of gas output, keep the gas flow not less than 15 liters per minute. Turn on the power. Clamp the safety ground clamp to the welding work table. Connect the nozzle and scale tube and tighten. Adjust the welding focal length. Choose the focus position where the spark splash is the largest as the zero focus, which is also the welding focus. Tighten the nut. Take off the single screw and washer from the wire feeding tube's welding end. Pass the wire feeding copper tube through the locking bracket at the welding head. Put the washer Tighten the nut. Do not tighten first. Insert the wire feeding small tube to the bottom of the copper tube. Use the wrench within the package to tighten the locking nut. End turn on the wire, feeder power switch. Click the setting menu to switch the system. Click the manual wire feed button when the welding wire passes through the wire feeding tube. Refix the bracket. Adjust the distance between the copper nozzle and the welding nozzle to 1 to 2 m. Tighten the fixing nut of the bracket. Adjust the welding parameters. Please refer to specific parameters according to Bodweld or Hill Annual or your welding experiences. Make sure the focus and the welding wire position are consistent. Now you are ready to start welding. Next, here are steps to replace the window protective lens. Lay the dust-free cloth included in the package. Use adhesive paper to seal the welding nozzle. During the replacement, make sure that the operation environment is clean and tidy. Open the protective lens cabin of the welding head. Take out the window protective lens holder and close the cabin. Rotate the locking piece 90 degrees clockwise and take it off. Put the piece on the dust-free cloth. Take out the damaged lens. 
Take one new protective lens included with the package. Peel off one side of the protective film on the new lens. Use the other side to align the lens to the lens holder. Do not touch the lens directly so your fingerprint doesn't pollute the lens. Put the locking side of the lens locking piece down on the protective lens. Rotate the locking piece 90 degrees counterclockwise until it tightens the lens. Insert the lens holder into the welding head. Please refer to the instruction manual included with the package for welding techniques or refer to this picture in the video. You can also adjust flexibly according to your welding experiences. Alter, dare to dream.